What's up everybody and welcome back. So you've seen me make this one. I decided to make a giant one and now you're going to see me inlaying some logos onto the side in order to give it away at a charity raffle at Maker Central 2022. Let's go! You heard me right. I am making more mallets because why wouldn't I? These are so cool. That's my one, which is not ever going anywhere. This is mine. So I've decided to make a giant one. The thing that will take this to the next level for the charity raffle will be inlaying some logos on the side. One of my good friends, Matt at Watson Woodwork, CNC these logos out for me, which I'm going to inlay into the mat head. And it's gonna look epic because walnut is awesome and it'll look lovely against the oak. So the first thing I'm gonna do is tidy up these circles. Cause it will ricochet, I will let it by. I will look at you and tell you that I so, um, I can't be bothered to move the camera, so I'm going to talk to you now. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to resaw this down to cut down on how much I actually have to inlay. Okay, so I'm pretty much at the stage now where I just need to actually do the inlay and I've got a bit, I'm really nervous about that. So for this, I'm going to be using my Ford Two Flute Upcut Finishing Bit. I don't want to mess this up because this is the only one I've got. Okay, so Maker's logo in there, and I believe that it will go down far enough for it to be fine. Because now I've got to do my logo on the other side. Um, I'll probably just skip this bit because you've seen me do the other one. Okie dokie, so I am at the stage now where my inlays are pretty much done and to be fair it's a good job I am because all of my Ryobi batteries have just run out. There you go, that is starting to look really good. For the minute, all done. I've added some filler to the outside just to uh, cover in some of the gaps. I'm gonna let this dry. I'm not gonna sand it off now because what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna add some resin to this in order to make those that CNC logos popped on both sides. Uh, so that's gonna be my next video. So if you wanna see what it looks like when it's totally finished and totally cleaned up, check out the next video. Thank you so much for watching guys. It means the world to me that you do. Don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, and share. You know, there's other people that want to see this content as well. There's some videos over here. Check them out. If you want to watch something similar, I've got the Jason Voorhees machete you can watch. And if not, I'll see you next time. Thanks very much.